All right, Bob, so today's the first full day of summer, mm -hmm. and Mother Nature decided to just do full-blown summer and give us <laughs> what triple heck? digits all She's of a sudden. blowing <laughs> out the stops this week. Let's get it out of the way. Yeah. Wait till you see the warming trend we have in that mm. extended forecast. Let's get right to it. I don't love That's it. one of our weather headlines today. Here we go. Checking out our weather headlines. Oh, we have video. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I you have a special treat. Oh yeah, I forgot all about this. <laughs> yeah, I went to uh, Firebird Raceway, the fox hunt. If you've never seen a jet dragster, well, here's what it looks like. They actually uh, put down some water on the track behind the uh, jet dragsters. Because one year the uh, track actually caught on fire. <laughs> and you'll see those guys take off. It looks like they're in a wow. hurry to get somewhere. <laughs> Bob. And that is 277 miles per hour. I don't know if you can hear the announcer. 277 miles per hour on that run. That was I-84 at Eagle. Yeah, <laughs> I-84 at Eagle. That's that's right. That's the morning commute. Not during rush hour. <laughs> a, uh, on one of the funny cars, uh, the parachute did not open up, and he took a little uh, journey out into the uh, field Ooh, at the end hey. of the track. That's going to be scary. So that's a look at jet dragsters this morning. Firebird Fox Hunt, so one of many events that happened over the weekend. There's our weather headline. Summer is here. More dry weather and record weekend heat coming our way. Some triple digits by the weekend. Here is a live look at the depot this morning. A beautiful uh, sunrise out there. 58 degrees. Winds are calm. Humidity at 60 percent. The feels like temperature about 58. Here's some other temperatures across our region. Boise at 58 degrees. McCall checking in with 43 degrees. Stanley at 37 and Haley at 46 degrees. Our Almanac page calls for a forecasted high of 88 for today. The overnight low, a mild 60 degrees. Both those above normal by a few. And a couple degrees cooler than yesterday. Yesterday we hit 90 degrees. Normal for the state, 84 and 55. And we certainly have the potential of seeing some record heat on this date, Monday, June 22nd, 104, our record back in 1988. And as we get closer to the weekend, we'll be approaching some record heat. Well, here's our future cast. This is a wide view. Basically, those lines are kind of west to east. That's our zonal flow or west to east jet stream flow. But uh, check out the, uh, the lines as they, we head into Thursday on into Friday. We see a big high pressure ridge build, almost like a mountain. That's why the uh, lines are heading to the north, a high pressure ridge over uh, the desert southwest that will expand northward. And that's when things will really start heating up on Friday, on into Saturday, on into Sunday. It looks like that ridge is gonna be with us for a while. So possibly some uh, very warm temperatures the first part of next week as well. Here's our satellite and radar view. We have a few clouds moving by to the north across the uh, central portion of the state. A few showers in northern Idaho, but those have moved off into Montana. Here's our future cast. We'll just let this thing roll. You're not going to see a lot of changes here as we head into Tuesday, on into Wednesday. A few clouds pushing by to the north, but that is about it. Here's the tight view as we look at uh, southwestern Idaho. Again, just a smattering of clouds at times for mostly sunny skies, but much of the day will be sunny. And we're looking at some really nice days ahead, but uh, temperatures will be warming up. Enjoy these somewhat cooler temperatures today. We're still going to be above normal in the Twin Falls area for Sun Valley, a high near 76 degrees with, with sunny skies, 73 for Stanley's high. Riggins about 87 for the high. And McCall and Cascade, you're looking at daytime highs in the mid 70s. And for the western end of the valley, highs pretty close to 90 degrees for Payette. You'll be one of the warmer locations in Cannon County, looking at uh, daytime highs in the mid 80s to upper 80s. And for Boise, High near 88. Again, yesterday's high was 90, so maybe just a tad cooler. Not so you're going to notice a whole lot, though. Back to 90 on Tuesday. As we head into Thursday, highs reaching into the mid-90s, upper 90s by Friday. And there is that near-record heat on Saturday and Sunday. 103 on Saturday, 104 on Sunday. That's a look at weather.